I really want to know if he's cheating or not. What if he just gets shitted on right now? Never mind. I should have just kept my right shield. Yeah. Pathetic. Doesn't even deserve that win. Hacking and just just getting 16 kills. Uh, what a piece of shit. Better. Welcome back guys. I know it's been like a week or so. I apologize sincerely. I just been really stressed out with YouTube and school and I just haven't found any room to upload so, so I apologize deeply. But anyways we're back and we're gonna be playing some Warzone. So the class I'm gonna be running is the Glil with the SPR. Sorry I just needed to turn the music down it was too loud. But anyways this is the class that Phage Dev runs. I think he actually runs different mags but i'll just use these because why not and i've seen a lot of people use this galil and it's like really op or something i heard that stadium is like really broken and then you're able to actually get under stadium and you can shoot wherever you want and nobody can kill you while you're under there and the only way to get out of it is either if you use the rapple or you get a vehicle i haven't died to anyone but i know that face just made a video on spectating somebody that was under stadium so basically i'm not just gonna go to stadium that hacker yesterday man <sighs> i made it to top five and i was just driving around in my truck and then all of a sudden i just die instantly and the guy was shooting at me i thought he was just trying to damage my vehicle because he saw it smoking but he was actually hacking and i just thought he got really lucky with that shot when he killed me you guys didn't see it because i didn't start recording until after the fact he killed me and i knew he was a hack but yeah he killed me and i just started spectating him i've been playing a little more and i've just been having less anxiety now i actually thought i was gonna win that game but i mean obviously he's probably gonna get banned because there were seven people spectating him so i saw something really cool on charlie intel's page where someone actually made a pc that looked like the buy station it was pretty cool i'm not gonna I got a glue, that's good. Someone dropped with me, so but I don't know where you went. Got a good amount of cash. I'm gonna call on UAV because I don't know where this guy is. Recon's inbound. What 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 just happened right now? Oh my god. I just absolutely destroyed him and they still haven't fixed this glitch. I remember when that happened when there was like a bunch of cash on the floor and I couldn't get it. I was really mad. Oh my god. See, that striker is way too strong. I was lagging hell a lot too. Alright, so we kind of have a rough start. I mean, we could come back from this. It's just the thing with this game is that what you don't expect to happen, happens. There's two Berthas and SUVs. I'm gonna just hit this building and see what I can get. Hoping that, oh, there's somebody here. I just know it. Watch, there's gonna be somebody here and he's just gonna have a striker and absolutely destroy me. C4. I never, I actually never seen C4 on the ground, to be honest. That's just great. No extra plates. This AK that I hope it's good. I know this is really a scummy way to play, but I mean, this guy has a bounty on me. He knows where, I, where exactly I am. See, with these videos, I can never test on my loadouts whatsoever. Alright, there's two guys in Alberta coming over here i think this is the guy that wants me dead or some shit i don't know you're a fucking bitch <laughs> he was so mad and he had his heartbeat too bro oh my how how embarrassing is that for you you legit thought i'm sorry but i had no let out and nothing else my man was not happy about that one and somehow i still got him i actually thought i was dead but luckily i put that c4 oh my god hasta luego my friend you ain't catching me I knocked his armor. I'm gonna stay away from this guy because I'm not sure if he has explosives. That's one thing I have to be afraid of. I mean, I wouldn't say I'm doing the best right now. I mean, I don't. I have my loadout, but I don't have plates at all. I should probably go scavenge them. Come back stronger next time. And he's using a heartbeat sensor from all the way up here. I mean, you're gonna have to move it away, my guy. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be the rest of my video. <laughs> he's so afraid to shoot. <laughs> that was just great. We got stinky ball cheese. Stopping power rounds. Ooh. Damn, he has 26k. Oh my god. He has everything. He has his loadout, stopping power rounds, 28k, eight plates, satchel, gas mask. This guy is set. Oh my god. Is this face Jeb or something? Face Jeb would have already been dead. He would have been spectating with me already. He's gonna get his loadout, probably ghost loadout. Yeah. Eight people remaining. Let's see what he does. Level 416 already, too. I never actually really used the RAM in Warzone. It's just an average gun, to be honest. He has the high ground. In circle. All he has to do is just watch behind him just in case if anybody's just crouch walking. A third party going on. Missed. This guy jumps into the storm. I mean, he has nowhere else to hide. He's, he's gonna die to the storm or he's gonna die to one of these guys. Takes that guy out. Misses. Oh, how do you miss that? That was a bad play on his part. He should have uh, armored up. Lago kid over here. And he gets the dub. Get 10 kills too. 
The things that I did bad on my part was that I guess I was just too comfortable with my surroundings. But anyways, that's gonna wrap up the video. It feels pretty good to be back since it's been a week. Even though a week sounds like a little bit, it, it truly helped me. I have like less anxiety now just playing the game in total. Like my heart doesn't race every time I come into a counter and I feel like other people heard that counter and then they're now coming to toward my way. Anyways guys, hope you guys did enjoy and have a tropical day in paradise.